Hello everyone. Welcome back to the tutorial. And this tutorial is the continuity of my previous tutorial in which I have showed you the shading part and the node graph. And in this video I just want to show you uh, the lighting techniques I have used in this scene. It's a, a small video. So in the previous video you have seen how did I do the procedural shading I mean the marble and the gold pattern and blending them together and in this video it's only about the lighting so as you can see here if I'm going to the uh, viewport uh, rendering you can see the marble here in the viewport texture but in the render you can see the Lambert because I have overread a material which is a basic uh, principled BSDF with a diffuse color of 0 0.25 and nothing else I have changed. I generally do lighting on Lambert so that I can see uh, how it is exactly working on it. Initially my approach was to do a 3 point lighting but after doing 3 point lighting I felt like uh, fill light was not required so all I did was let me switch off as you can see there is nothing in the environment light this scene is completely lit by two lights so as you can see here it's a key light area light I'll show the ad attributes and the rim light I always like backlight and the rims see it gives you the dynamic feeling yeah. coming to my light placement as you can see here I have placed a light exactly back of the model and one in the 45 degrees and my camera focal length is 50 mm let me show you my light intensity and the color they are just white in color so if I press 0 you can see let me remove the override material now you can see the lighting just two lights one is key light, one is rim light. I hope you all like this video and there are series of videos coming on how to do procedural shading and also the lighting and all the tips and tricks which I have learned in recent years and working uh, Blender in production as well. So please do subscribe and follow on Instagram.